Alright, so for this first one, you're going to want to start at the Crumbling Beast Grave Depths and Azula. And you can choose to run past these guys if you want, but I'm always worried about getting swarmed, so I'd kill them if I were you. Um, after that, you just go outside and up this roof. It doesn't really look like there's uh, another way up to the third floor. And uh, with the holes in the floor up here, uh, as well as the fact that you can only get up there with the roof, I think we can probably question the competence of both the architect and whoever constructed this place. <coughs> um, I'd take these guys out again just so you don't get swarmed. And when you come up to these guys, there are going to be three enemies, and you should focus the one that glows red because they can kill you pretty quickly. Be careful how much noise you make up here though, because there's another one on the floor below that actually killed me through the floor uh, on, on an earlier run. Alright, for the second one, you're going to want to start out at the Dragon Temple Altar. I'm going to be showing you how to get to a fog gate from here, so you're going to need a couple of stone sword keys to get in. I'll just say this isn't an average fog gate, there's a lot to explore past it, and I'm not going to show you everything there, uh, only how to get there from here.
And after you jump down from here, it'll just bring you back to a place that you've already been. So that's it for this one. For this one, you start out at the Dragon Temple rooftop. If you're being attentive, I think this one might be hard to miss, but for those of you who may have taken a different route, I'm including this one. As we're going up the elevator here, you'll see a little place that you can drop off. You should do that when you come back down uh, the elevator, and it'll take you back to the first area with the two birds that you fought. For this one, you again start out at the Dragon Temple rooftop. This one is a little tricky, and I'm sorry if there's an easier way to do it. I looked for one, but just wasn't fortunate enough to find one. The tricky part is this little bridge coming up. There's a tiny platform that you need to land on, and it'll take you to a level below the uh, main area. I died a few times trying to get this to happen, so don't feel bad if you do. And again, sorry if there's an easier way. And you'll notice these guys over here are having a party. I tried to fight them one time, and I decided they were more trouble than they were worth, so I just ran past them on the next attempt, which I recommend also doing, unless you're feeling daring. After you grab this talisman up here, you can run back the way you came, if you killed the Crucible Knight, or if you think you can handle him now. I opted to just fall onto the platform again. After you kill this bird, there's going to be a, another knight over in the building. I didn't see anything that was past him, but you're obviously welcome to explore. 
Um, thank you for watching, and if you have any recommendations on how to make this better, or if you notice we've missed something, please let us know in the comments. See ya.